Wichita, Wichita. You think there's like an alternate reality where Peyton Manning said Wichita instead of Omaha? I mean, it's highly plausible. It's all a simulation. It is. It's all a simulation. What's up guys, so we are in Kansas right now going to make a Michael's delivery in Wichita. And as you can see, it's beautiful Kansas. This is actually one of my favorite states to travel through trucking is Kansas. How do you think about Kansas? I like it so far. It's been an easy day. Yeah? Look at that guys. It's nice, ain't it? It's pretty out there. I don't care what anybody says, Kansas is a pretty state. You know, I've done all the mountains like out west, but it's a pretty state in its own right. Every state has its own charm. Except for Texas. Just joking, guys. I love Texas too, okay? Just the west side. Dylan's Grocery. Wait, a what violation? Wait, violation. What the hell? <laughs> well, you called me back. I, think. <laughs> I mean, I hope that's wrong. I haven't seen any new trucks or. You haven't seen any signs? Anything about wait. Okay. Oh, well, here comes the sign. Wait. For big trucks, 38 tons. We ain't 38 yeah, tons. Violation. We ain't that heavy. That's 4, yeah. Oh, no. 38 times 2. Yeah. Yeah. It's way more than us. Yeah, it's like 76. Yeah. So, yeah. You're good. Math is hard. <laughs> All right. 0 0.2 North Mays Road, and then we are almost there. They just started going to. Right on that curve. You are right on that curve, dear. Are you gonna make it? But that's be right here. Yeah, it's incorrect because our load notes stated to turn by the Walmart and the B dubs. And when we like Google Map and Street View that, it has us going in the wrong direction where the dock would be in front of us on a narrow back alley. And there ain't no way to back into it that way. So we figured out a better route up here to turn into the alleyway going the correct direction to back into this Michael's dock. So, yeah, take matters into our own hands. Hopefully our research is correct. Yeah, I think it will be. Yeah, I think it will be too, but you never really know. You never know till you get there, but oh dang, I didn't realize this barricade was here. Yeah. <laughs> Michael's right there. Approaching destination in 900 feet on the left side. All right, guys, we're going to take this left, and then there's going to be a left to go back behind the alleyway. Oh, there's an academy across the street. You have arrived at your destination on the left side, 2727 and Maze Road. What, what's a super target? Uh, maybe we should go find out. Super target? It's like a Walmart super center? Oh yeah, they got a whole they got a whole grocery. So here's where we turn in, guys, right here. If this car would move. Go, please, go. I need you to go. Yeah, we need you to go, dude. That took a while. Lord. No sense at all. Oh crap. This van's just gonna have to wait. Block them. Take this right.
Where are we going? I think we should go get some Mediterranean. Yeah. What's it called again? The Bella Luna Cafe West. Bella Luna Cafe West. We looked that up earlier today and it had really good reviews. Looked really good. We both love Mediterranean food, so yeah, I'm down. All right, guys, so we did decide on some Mediterranean food. The Bella Grand Bella Luna. Opera. Bella yeah, Luna. Um, <laughs> I don't know what it was called. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're going to go to Bella Mediterranean food. So we'll show you guys some pictures. Got a Best Buy right here as well. See, I wish every trucking stop had just stuff around it like this. Like this is, this doesn't happen all the time. This is the dream. This is the dream for an OTR driver to have all of this stuff around. It's like, a, you're, you're like a kid in a candy store whenever you finally get somewhere like this. Or even a Walmart. Yeah. I don't know how excited I've been to walk into Walmart after being on the road two weeks. <laughs> Here it is, Bella Luna Cafe. It had like, it was like one of the top rated restaurants here, so that's why we decided to get it. Here we go. This looks amazing. They have a lot of awards. <laughs> All right, so we got a Euro lamb and filet mignon. It's pretty fabulous. It's amazing. It's real good. Billy Joe, what did they have in the bathroom? They had complimentary mouthwash in the bathroom. Complimentary mouthwash. With cups and dispenser and all that. I've never seen that in my life. I've never seen it either. That's crazy. All right, guys. So we're in the Target Super Center, and uh, we each got stockings to get each other a stocking thing. So we're going to buy our stuff secretly and separately. And uh, yeah. Let's see what we get Billy Joe. Comfy socks. Take yourself on somewhere. <laughs> she likes these. Yeah. Supernova little trees test. Now that's interesting. So we do love playing some Uno in the truck, but we've never tried this. Flip the deck. So I think I'm going to add that to her uh, stocking too. She loves Starbucks. Let's go ahead and get her this. Ooh, she's going to love that. that. That's the kicker right there, boy. Okay, these candles are way nicer. Let's get her one of these. And put the other one back. She loves her chapstick. And she loves this extra gum. Guys, as a man, I was going to get some uh, lotion, but I really don't know what to get because <laughs> I don't really do this. But I don't know. This pink one caught my eye. St. Ives Gentle Smoothing Scrub. Rose water and aloe vera. Sounds good to me. Okay, that's it. All right, guys, so I think that was a pretty solid uh, stocking stuffer for Billy Joe. Um, I almost got her a Switch game because she likes to play her Switch on the truck, but I don't really know what game she wants right now. And I've tried asking her before, you know, like, what games do you want? Is there any games you want? And she's like, oh, not really. So, yeah. I don't really know what to get, so I didn't get her Switch game. So I kind of got her a Starbucks gift card instead. So I figured that'd be nice. I'm interested to see what she gets me when the time comes. So we'll film it whenever we open our stockings. So. Yeah, now I'm just hanging out on a bench. <laughs> I don't know why I just panned over the bench. There you guys go. But <laughs> waiting for Billy Joe. And uh, yeah, gonna head back to the truck, go to sleep, get up in the middle of the night and make the delivery. What'd you get me? Can't tell you. I like quintuple bagged your stuff. You can't even see what's in there. That's my Mountain Dew you're seeing. <laughs> What'd you get me? I can't tell you. Okay. I got myself some stuff too. And I should have worn a belt today. <laughs> Pants falling down? Yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, so we are going to go ahead and open our uh, Christmas stockings that Billy Joe and I got for each other. So, you wanted me to go first or did you want to go first? You can give me mine first. Give you yours first? Yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> and let me Thanks. film you opening it. 
So I put some, uh, pa I didn't get any little fluff papers like you put in a bag, so I just put paper towels in there. Tissue paper. Tissue paper, oh, yeah. yes. I like that the tag is still on it. Oh, I forgot to take the tag. <laughs> start there. <laughs> Had to turn on the other light because it was too dark in here. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> what? Uno. Uno, yes. Flip. So that's oh a new God. one. What? I guess it's a new one. It's a different one. So you play with two sides? I guess. I don't know how. I don't. I just saw it was a new Uno, and I was like, "Yeah, let's get it," because we like Uno. Oh, so they have flip cards in the deck, and then you have to turn your cards over. I like that. Can we play like today? Yeah. While we're getting on. Oh yeah, we can. Okay. I'm down. I'm gonna make breakfast, and then we're gonna play that. Okay. It's gonna be like legit Christmas. <laughs> oh, oh my God! <laughs> Supernova. What does it smell like? I have no clue. Oh, it smells. It smells like your cologne. Did you do that? Does it? It does. No, I didn't. I had no smell clue. It. Tell me that does not smell like your cologne. I can't believe you just told me my cologne smells like a little tree. Really? <laughs> like, like I spent good money on my cologne. You tell me it smells like a little tree. Well, like, you could just <laughs> use these. Just hang these under your shirt. All the time. <laughs> it does smell like that. It smells good though. Yeah, for sure. I like it. And it's all like space. That's why I got it. I just thought it looked cool. I was got like, maybe it. she would like it for her car or the truck, whatever. Reese's Pieces, okay. You do like Reese's Pieces, don't you? Yeah. That was just something I was like, I don't know. I've never seen her eat Reese's Pieces, but I felt like you can't go wrong with those. I eat Reese's all the time, though. Yeah. Well, not all the time. I wish I could all the time. These are so soft. Okay. So it said like a women's four to ten, and I knew that you were like a seven, right? Seven and a half. Seven and a half. Okay. So I knew that those should probably fit, but it's got pink one and uh, like a different one, comfy socks. I'm about to put these on right now. Yeah. It's like 20 degrees here. It is cold outside. <laughs> so I'm gonna put those back there. Starbucks gift card. Yep. I knew you'd like that. That was that was the bread and butter in there. Was yeah. that one? Oh my god, my favorite gum. Oh my god. Yep. Okay. She eats so much extra gum. It keeps me awake. It does. You got me so much. All right. <laughs> but I, it sounds like I failed with the lotion, guys. Yeah, I told him when I was in there, I was like, I'm a man. I don't know what type of lotion I'm supposed to get, but it looked cool. Wait, it, is this lotion? Oh, is it not? Oh god, what did I get? Oh god, what is it? Well, it says gentle soothing scrub, so it's for like your skin. Oh, okay, yeah, it's yeah. Not lotion. It had aloe on it and stuff, I saw. Yeah. So I thought, I don't know. I I really didn't know. I mean, I'll use it. Okay, good. Because it's good to exfoliate your skin, especially in the winter. But I think it's like a body wash kind of thing. Oh, well, that's, that's cool too. Yeah. All right. Yeah, you cool. meant to do that, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Body wash. That's it. It is a candle. Ooh. Can I burn one right now? I don't know what it smells like though. It smells like winter citrus and pine and cinnamon and stuff. <laughs> I hate cinnamon. Yeah, I do hate cinnamon, but, but the smell of cinnamon is really good. Yeah. I will deal with it for you. What else is that? I forgot what else I got. Chapstick. Oh yeah, she loves her chapstick. Because what, what chapstick flavors were brand. it? What flavors? Spearmint, cherry, and strawberry. You like cherry, don't you? Yeah, I like all of them. Did you know there was a spearmint one? Because I didn't. I did know that. Oh. I think I got it one time, but then I left it in my car and it melted. Oh no. So I had to throw it away. Well, I, I knew that, so I replaced it for yeah. you. Yeah, you knew that. <laughs> What's this? Oh. What is that? I forgot. Oh yeah, I knew you like peanut butter M&Ms. Oh my god, they're my favorite. There you go. You know me so well. These are like all of my favorites. Okay, and then more gum. That's it. Yep, that's it. You did good. Did I? Yeah. Okay, awesome. Well, I guess I'll open mine now. All right, so this is good god. This thing is freaking huge. What all did you stuff in here? <laughs> Well, you're about to find out. But wait, there's one thing that wouldn't fit in there. So, oh, so I get it. Gotta, this? Yeah. So this I just is look at this first. Whatever you want to oh, do. I think I know what you got me. Oh my God! I did not know they even had this. You were probably so excited when you found it. Yes, you know I was. I was like, this is perfect. A whole box of Toffee Bays. So I love these guys. They're awesome. If you never had them, just try them. Trust me. It's like 
sex in the mouth. Probably shouldn't have said that for YouTube <laughs> or for CFI. Uh, it's like heaven in your mouth. What is this? What? Good Lord, what'd you get me, a damn sweater? You said you wanted hoodies. I did want hoodies. I didn't know if you would like that things. one because you already oh, have a green one. That's pretty, actually pretty legit. Look at that. I do need hoodies. I've been eating. Oh, they're here. All right, guys, so Michaels came and knocked on the door, and we had to back into the dock when we were in the middle of this, but uh, I got my new hoodie on that she just got me, and uh, fits good, look good. Yeah, look good. I like it. And, oh, is this a t-shirt? Oh, yeah. Heck yeah. I, I hope it fits you. What size is it? It's is it medium? medium? Yeah, yeah, medium shirts always fit me. I like nice. that color. It's like my favorite color, yeah. so. I don't have too many shirts that are this color. Is it like a dark blue? Yeah. yeah. I have a few, I think, but not many. Uh, yeah. Thank you. It's different. It's I swear in this lighting it looks different, but yeah. in Target it looks different. Okay. But I think I'll it'll look good on you. It. I'll wear it. And <laughs> <laughs> you really got me a pop socket. I know. She's dying laughing behind the camera right now because she knows. Actually, if I were to get any pop socket. This like carbon fiber looking one actually is really cool. Like that's definitely a manly pop socket if I had one. I almost got you a space one. Really? But I just know you need one in your life. Yeah. Even though you don't know it yet. I keep telling her I don't want one. <laughs> she keeps trying to get me to get one. Now she bought me one so I have to try the pop socket. Now. You don't have to try it. I'm just saying it's it'd be a good idea for your life. It's for your phone guys if some of y'all didn't know what uh, this was for. It goes on the back of it, makes it easier to hold. Yeah, comment below if you use a pop socket and it's life changing, because yeah. I think it is. I got a bottle opener that's not attached to the thing. <laughs> Where'd it go? It's for all those oh. flavored sodas that we always yeah. get and we can't open. We can't open them, so and every time we get we the flavors. Struggle. Yeah, every time we get the flavored sodas, we gotta like use a lighter or something else to open it. So this will be nice for uh, all the crazy drinks we try. So yeah. And I think that, is that it? Or is there something else? I nope. don't know. That is it. Okay. Awesome. Yeah, you got me more than I got you. Well, we didn't even know. We kind of just grabbed stockings, but you got me big stuff though, and a freaking hoodie, like. Yeah, and I had a pump for your football in there too, but I had to take that out last minute because it wasn't gonna work. So I had so more. So then we could throw the football? Yeah. You wanna go throw it right now? Kinda. No, you don't, it's too cold, you would say. Yeah, but we could throw it like once and then it would be too cold and our hands would hurt. Right back in. <laughs> yeah. Alright guys, so that is everything that we got in our stockings for each other. Um, thank you, Billy Joe. You're welcome. That was nice of you. Now I'm gonna go make us some breakfast. Yes. Alright guys, well, that's gonna do it for this video. Alright guys, so that is gonna do it for this video. Hope y'all enjoyed it. As always, if y'all would like to join CFI, go down to the link in the description or the comments. I have a link there, take you to the landing page. If you'd like to get your trucking career started or you're an experienced driver that wants to come over, come on over, take you to the Riding with Dave page, and yeah, we'll catch y'all on the next one. Peace. Let's take a spin to a foreign place. These open highways are calling our name, and now it's time for us to escape. Escape to a world we don't know. Escape. Into the great unknown Escape To a world we don't know Escape Into the great unknown